fresh signs of a bipartisan Senate border deal emerging on Capitol Hill, with negotiators reaching an agreement on at least one key area, granting the Biden administration the authority to shut down the southern border if migrant crossings reach a certain level. They are also settling on a provision to speed up the process for migrants seeking asylum. It gives President uh, Biden expanded authority to shut down illegal crossings, and it also allows him to allocate more resources for due process uh, with immigration judges and magistrates for those coming here through legal ports of entry. This is a win-win. But there are still major questions lingering on whether enough Republicans will line up to back the package, especially now that former President Donald Trump has urged Republicans to reject any compromise in order to prevent President Biden from a political victory. The details of the legislation are still being hammered out, with negotiators planning on working through the weekend. We haven't seen any text or language about the deal. I've been very, very solid in my response of I will not vote for anything that makes illegal legal. A sign of the challenges that remain, House Speaker Mike Johnson is calling the deal dead on arrival in the House. And without some GOP backing, Congress will leave critical aid to both Ukraine and Israel hanging in the balance. That this is going to be a political football probably for the next uh, 12 months and, and, and potentially going farther. Lawmakers plan on releasing the bill text early next week. In New York, CB Cotton, Fox News.